<laughs> 15 million people watched a lovesick French woman trying to track down the man of her dreams. His name she had apparently forgotten. Natalie's plea attracted international headlines, taking calls from the likes of The Ellen Show, while at the same time playing us all for fools. Not every love story has a happy ending. And for me, it was love at first sight. Natalie was pregnant, a French damsel in distress, searching the world for a lost love. Please help me share this video and show your friends and hopefully he will see this. Her video captured the world's attention. My auntie shared it to me and she suspected it was me, but it wasn't. But it was all a hoax. I found him. She did, but there's a little twist. This has been a viral video for Holiday Malula Bar. It was a marketing stunt for local real estate agent Nigel Lucas. This is going to make a lot of people very upset, but you can't get promotion for the Sunshine Coast without creating a story. The social media man responsible for the campaign, Andy Seller, had a simple goal. What I wanted to do for this campaign is put Malula Bar on the map. It is now on the map. As for Natalie... She's an actress. She's not pregnant. She's got a steady boyfriend. They say any publicity is good publicity, but the locals, it seems, are not amused. What, what's the image of Malula Bar? Come here, party, get knocked up, don't know who, who the father is. There's definitely better ways to do something to get Malula Bar out. Andy joins us. And uh, Natalie, Natalie, you rocked her. No, her name's not Natalie. <laughs> That's oh. her, her real name is Alizé Michelle. Alizé, Alizé, you're a rotter. Are you Why even? Did you do this? Are you even French? Yes, I am. Oh, there you go. You know, Alizé, I yeah. felt really sad for you yesterday. I thought you were genuinely pregnant and looking for the father. How, how, what do you say to all those Australians who actually felt for you? Um, just I would like to say that uh, we made this video. Um, I made this video to help my friend and I didn't expect this to, to go that viral. Um, and I would like to say that uh, I'm sorry for the people who really wanted to help the girl. Um, yeah, oh, I mean, right. we, I didn't want to abuse... We were having to, fun with it. Yeah, Let's not get too serious about I've... this. It was a bit of no, a fun. people are really been... angry though. Well, we've all been punked. You know, that's what it's all about. Andy, 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 you're the rotter. Yeah. What happened here? What inspired <laughs> you with the idea? You should be copying. Look, it, um, it was, um, you know, it was, it was an idea I thought a thousand people would see, and I just wanted to promote Malula, but I didn't know it was going to go viral around the world. Um, yeah, I mean, it was, it was just a low-key joke that I was doing. Um, I didn't think what would happen would happen, so I'm sorry about that. <laughs> but did you? I mean. It's upset a lot of people. Do you, do you think it might backfire on Malula Bar and the people will uh, actually be annoyed no. by this and not come anywhere near you guys? No, 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 no. I, I spoke to the local business owners yesterday and they were happy because now everyone knows Malula Bar and where it is. And now it's the top three trending word on the entire internet, Malula Bar. Um, right. That's got to have a positive effect. Is it a bit of a raunchy place? Do people hook up and party? Is it a party place? I, I wish it was. Um, oh. No, not really. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. okay. <laughs> so, Alizé, what, what does your boyfriend make of all of this? I don't have any boyfriend. Oh. oh. We were told you're in a steady uh, relationship. Well, maybe you can go to our yeah, because... then. <laughs> it's <Yeah>. over. <laughs> no, I mean, the guy who talked uh, about me, he doesn't know me. So, he said I was 26, studying tourism. Had a boyfriend since five years, but all all of this is wrong. I mean, I'm saying management. I'm 23 and I'm single, but oh. that's okay. That, oh. Yeah. So okay. So you got punk too. What's going on? I can't. I don't know. It's real anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. All right. I don't. Well, I'm in, in the overall scheme of things. <laughs> yes, a lot of people got punk, so they're angry. In the overall scheme of things, mm. started out as a bit of fun, took on a life of its own. Give Alizé a bit of a break. Let's yes. not get too grumpy. In three or four weeks' time, we'll be laughing about it. So yes. There'll be a lot of men on the Sunshine the Coast thing. going, yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> and Alizé, are you looking for a man? 
Sorry? Are you looking for Are you a man? Looking for a man? Um, not exactly. <laughs> oh. Oh. Are you looking you for a woman? Not that there's any, anything wrong no, with no, that. No, no, no. That's. <laughs> oh, okay. No, she's just no, happy no, being single. Just Good girl, the... Alizy. <laughs> just. Just one yeah, of Yeah. Are you two a couple? No, I'm okay. single, but I'm looking. <laughs> this is turning into a weird dating thing. <laughs> a weirdness. <laughs> I've got no okay. hope. No one's going to come near me now. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Um, all, right. all right. Well, Andy, good luck. Sorry yes. I got cranky, Alice, but I did feel for you yesterday. Yeah. I've used a lot right, of emotion right, worrying about Very you. Nice. But it's all right. We'll all move on. All right. Nice to meet you. It's Thank a bit you. of fun. All right. <laughs> there you go. Bye.